Alright guys, welcome back finally to some more Pokemon Go. So, it's been a really long time since Blue and I went downtown and we recorded that episode. But since then, I've gotten to level 19. I think at the time of that downtown video, Blue and I, uh, well Blue was only like level 5. And then uh, I think I was level 15. Basically, I have three Eevee evolutions that are my top ones because Eevees are like the easiest ones to get high level. And I have a Flareon that is 1100. Basically, I evolved him and I put in the name Pyro so that I could uh, get the Flareon because I've never had a Flareon yet, so I needed it. And then uh, the other two are my Vaporeons, and then uh, I got a gold bat because I had like a 400 CP Zubat. I'm like, alright, let's just uh, go ahead and evolve him. And then uh, Scyther right there is my uh, one that hatched from my 10 kilometer egg. I think it was my first 10 kilometer egg. The other 10 kilometer was like an Eevee, so it was like great. It wasn't even a high CP Eevee at all. So uh, yeah, here's the rest of the team. Just evolved a few Pokemon that I thought were decently high CP, but I don't know. For being level 19, it feels like I'm not getting like as high of CP Pokemon as I should be. They nerfed um, Vaporeon, actually. If you look at the Water Gun ability, it used to be 10, I think, so they nerfed that down to 6. So it still probably attacks as fast, but it's just less damage. So we got that. And then, yeah, that's basically the update for the team. I have a 10km egg on me right now, but that's going to take a while to hatch because we're not even one km in. And then I've got a few other ones. So, that's where we're going at. We need to get more Pokeballs. I'm only down to like 11, and then the raspberries are kind of low too. So, we're going to check in the, around the park, see if we can get those things. Alright, made it to the park. And I can already see a bunch of people over there off in the distance. And I looked at the uh, Pokemon Go app. And there's three lures set up on the Pokestops up there, so we're probably gonna head up that way. And then uh, up in the uh, by the lake here or the pond, there is a Valor Gym, and I just looked at this one, and it's actually kind of low rank. There's only one Pokemon in it, and it's a Flareon 1300. Even though it's higher than my uh, Vaporeons, I could definitely take it out because, well, uh, Vaporeon's gonna destroy a Flareon. So we're gonna head up that way, see what we got. I'll try to bring my camera and see if we can record anything. But there are a few people up there. And then uh, we're gonna walk all the way over to where that lake is and hopefully take down that gym today. And plus I need all these pokey stops anyway. There's also a gym back here too, but this one is really beefy. It's up to like level seven. This gym doesn't seem like it's too beefy though, so we're gonna head up there, get some pokey stops, maybe catch some Pokemon as we walk up there and uh, see if we can take down that gym. Okay, so here's where I'm hanging out right now. This pavilion over here is where the uh, pokey lures that we saw were. And uh, that's kind of where a lot of people here are hanging out. Oh, we actually got a Make sure you have a gasoline. Let me crash this quick. Please be high CP. 313, that's actually a little better than the other ones. I was trying to get this guy. That, I did not even curve that. I feel like that happens a lot. Look, I don't even curve that. Come on. Okay, there. Sometimes I swear I don't curve the Pokeball and it does it anyway. Let's try to get this guy. Okay, good. I don't know, unless I find a higher gas lead, that might be the one that I evolved. 313, I could evolve him. So it must, it must just be gas leads around here. And Rattatas. Of course, Pidgeys and Weedles are always around. So yeah, this is the area that I'm kind of hanging out right now. It's actually really nice today in the shade. And uh, over there is the lake. The gym is probably somewhere that way. So we could walk a little bit that way if I want to. Actually, I think I might head over there because I've already got these. And I don't really want to stay around these Poké Lures because they're not getting too much good Pokémon. Looks like I can reach the gym from here, so I'm going to sit in this bench. I'll try to do it. Alright, battle one. So let's go with the Vaporeon nerf here. I'm going to have to use my ability more. I used to just sit here and spam, but now that does less damage, so... Use Aqua Tail. That did a lot to me. Okay, we can use Aqua Tail again. I would try to dodge, but I don't know. Dodging, dodging is sometimes difficult. Plus, I'm holding with one hand. Oh come on, Cycle Shock! Can I just kill this this Hypno at least? Oh, I have my Aqua Tail again. Please, Aqua Tail. Okay, he should be he should be dead. Okay, good. Well, we survived with like one health on our first Vaporeon. Oh, this is the Flareon. Oh, but he already killed us. Okay, we have we have a uh, Vaporeon number two. I think Ted. We got Ted coming up. I feel like this one's a little worse because it doesn't have the Aqua Tail. Let's see how good... That did so much to me! Alright, let's keep going, let's keep going, let's keep going. Super effective, but we're still getting 
it's kind of destroyed. Okay, Flareon's down. Who's left? There's another Vaporeon. Yeah, there's a Vaporeon left. 1400 though. And I have to go up against my... Well, who do I got left? I have the Jolteon left, so we might be able to take him on with that. Probably deal some good damage. See, what I really need is one of these just huge Snorlaxes that just dominate the gyms at the number one <laughs> position. I'm sure they get these Snorlaxes at a pretty high level, then they just level it up a little more to get it up to certain like high CP. But I've never gotten a Snorlax yet or Lapras, so that's the goal. But that's what I was just looking at right now. One of the instinct gyms around here is controlled by that Snorlax. So I got these. All it is is the Rattatas and the Pidgeys. I'm not even going for them. Maybe even Weedles. So let's head back to the car, see if we can get any Pokestops along the way. Alright, so made it back to the car. Not as good as I would have hoped for the park here. I mean, there's a good amount of Pokestops, but the Pokemon just are not like that high quality. I feel like in the downtown park, the Pokemon are just way higher quality. Like, I'd rather get a ton of Magikarps than a ton of Pidgeys and a ton of Weedles. So, I might have to go back there. That's the entire reason that I'm level 19 right now. Is because I would go to that downtown a few days ago, or it was actually more like a week ago. I went down there and just camped in front of the three Poke Stops that they have, like all grouped up, and then went crazy like farming XP. So that's basically the best way to do it. Might have to record another episode of me going downtown. I might get blue to go, I might not, but uh, I'm gonna head home, maybe wrap up this episode, see if I can get anything on the way, if there's any good spots for uh, Poke Stops or anything like that. Because I don't have a ton of Pokeballs, but uh, yeah, I'm gonna head home and then we'll wrap up this episode. Alright, so that's gonna wrap it up for this episode of Pokemon Go. We got some Pokeballs, not like a ton, but I just really wanted to check out the park area to see if there's any good Pokestops or if there's any kind of new Pokemon, which there's not at all. It's the same ones, like Rattata, the Weedle. I think the coolest one that they had was some Gastly's, that's about it. So next time I'm planning on going back to downtown to the good area where I can get to level 20. That is the goal, to hit level 20 next time, maybe even more because I have uh, five lucky eggs left and we're gonna use up uh, maybe a few of those probably not all of them just to uh, Maximize how much XP we can get while we're there. So we're gonna be doing that hitting level 20 seeing if we get any new Pokemon um, I'm probably going to be evolving a lot of Pokemon because that'll also help once I pop the lucky egg I'm going to be evolving a ton of Pidgeys and then I think I have some other good Pokemon that I want to evolve I can evolve a Nidoran. I can evolve a Venonat I think. No, I can almost evolve a Venonat there was one other one. I can evolve a Psyduck. I was looking for a higher CP Psyduck though, because I have 75 candy, but I don't have a uh, really high Psyduck. I have a 425, but I feel like I can get a better one. I feel like I can get like a 500 Psyduck. So we're going to be looking for those when we go there. Uh, hopefully catch more Magikarps, because we still got a long way to go to get a Gyarados. And then uh, can I evolve a Shelter? No, I'm like really close to evolving a lot of these guys. But I can also evolve a Ghastly, but I kind of wanted to see if we got a higher level Ghastly. So that's probably going to do it for this Pokemon Go. So uh, be subscribed if you guys want to see more of it. Leave a big like on this video if you guys have enjoyed it. And I'll be back soon with that adventure downtown to get level 20 and hopefully a lot more than that too. And because uh, I got a lot of stuff. And I'm probably going to get more uh, of the incubator so I can get these eggs going. We can hatch more eggs. So we'll probably hatch a lot of eggs next episode. So next episode is going to be big, so I uh, look forward to that. And I hope you guys enjoy this video, and I'll see you all next time.